So, uh, David, in your work as a sleep physician at the Melbourne Sleep Disorder Centre, you see a range of different um, sleep problems. Can you describe a few of those and some of the common sleep problems people present with? Yeah, so people come for a range of different reasons. And in terms of symptoms, it often breaks down to, I'm having trouble sleeping, getting to sleep, staying asleep. I'm feeling tired, so feeling that sleep's not working for me. Or strange things are happening during sleep. Mm -hmm. And that's often at a sort of a patient level what the symptoms cluster to. Mm -hmm. But when we try and think of it about what the sleep disorders are and the different styles of sleep disorders, we really group them into one group called hypersomnias, and that's really excessive sleepiness conditions, mm -hmm. where people are feeling more tired than they'd expect to, and it's not because of something else. Mm -hmm. Then there's the insomnias, where people have trouble getting to sleep, trouble staying asleep. And another form of insomnia can be just feeling like sleep's not as restorative as what it could be, or mm -hmm. feeling that sleep's really light and on the surface. There's circadian rhythm disorders, which is more body clock disorders, so people can't get to sleep at the right time or can't wake up at the right time or shift work. Um, mm -hmm. Then there's what we call parasomnias. Think of that as you know, funny things that happen at night or movements that happen at night. Mm -hmm. So while people are asleep, they may have sleep walking, sleep talking, or twitching legs or yelling out. It's actually surprisingly common, mm -hmm. um, but often people don't talk about it uh, much. Uh, and then the other main group of disorders we see is people who just feel like they're not sleeping well in conjunction with other sleep problems mm -hmm. uh, or other health problems, both be it physical health or mental health. So depression and not sleeping well or arthritis and pain and not mm -hmm. sleeping well. Uh, and then there's a separate uh, group again of sleep breathing problems. So that's snoring, sleep apnea. So sometimes people just get a sense that, you know, I'm snoring or my partner said I've stopped breathing at night and I feel like I'm not sleeping well. And that's the sort of sleep disordered breathing or sleep apnea mm -hmm. group of disorders. Mm -hmm. Great, thank you. For the A to Z of sleeping well, head to the hub, sleephub.com.au.